Hey, Poppy, Poppy. There you go. <laughs> That's perfect. I'm going to start it off like this. Is it glistened up? It's glistened up. All right, here we go. All right, y'all, welcome back to another episode of Tasting with Tank. Y'all see... Tattoos with Tank. Tattoos with Tank. We getting tatted up, y'all. This is actually the <laughs> the, oh, the lobby. I keep doing that. You keep bad. doing that? This my is actually bad. the lobby of a tattoo parlor. I'm just playing. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no, hey, y'all, this time around, we are talking about... It's Tasting with Tank. Y'all know what it is. Y'all know who he is. Uh, he's the reason a lot of y'all found me. So... Kev on stage. That's my name. Hey, Kev This is Monty. Stage. Come here. Can you see him? This Monty's is the dog. The He's all in it. He's all in. All right. I'm going to put Monty on my shoulder. <laughs> he loves that. He's a baby. <laughs> uh, anyway, I don't know if y'all can tell or not, but we're going to talk about Kev's taste in these shoes. Yeah. You want to talk about it? How, where do you, so, you want to begin? This, this is, um, so we're, we're going to start off where your love of shoes came from. Okay. My love of shoes came from poverty. Um, you, you grew up in around the time of me. You remember East Bay Magazine? Yeah. Okay. East Bay Magazine would come out and everybody would circle the yeah. shoes that they want. A lot of kids I grew up with actually would get those shoes. But yeah, I, I knew But it's not me. Mm -hmm. I always circled. I remember there's some I circled month after month. So I remember being like, ah, oh, I want the, I want the new this. I want the Jordans. Yeah. I want the whatever everybody else has. <clears throat> but we never had no money for that. I remember one time, <laughs> my mom got me these basic Nikes from like Maxway or Family Dollar, some some secondhand store. They shouldn't even have had no Nikes. Maybe it was a dollar store. Yeah. Maybe not that's Family Dollar, but some store that was like not a reputable place. Yeah. And they had just some like basic Nikes with a little check mark on them, low top. Maybe like, not even shoe. be Nikes. Yeah. Probably might not even be. <laughs> and everybody was like, yeah, what is those? Because nobody had seen them, but it wasn't mm -hmm. a cool nobody had seen them. I was like, oh, these are the Nick Andersons. And people were like, Nick, Nick Anderson got a shoe? Because you're like, I mean, he's a, he's a good guard for the Magic, but I, is he signature shoe worthy? <laughs> but because there's no internet, there's no way to disprove that these aren't the Nick Andersons. What, what made you just Well, because Nick? I knew if I went Jordan, yeah. Penny. Oh, so you were just like. I had to do somebody who, off. Somebody just. To the somebody, side. Somebody to still drive a Toyota. Yes. <laughs> you know this person's in the NBA, but you yeah. don't know enough to say he doesn't have a signature shoe or do you, you don't even care. Yeah. So Nick Anderson, I, I went with that for, you know, a good year. And uh, <laughs> the first, <laughs> when I got my first real job, the first thing I did with my first check, I got the, I should get those again. I got the red and white patent leather Jordan 11s. I don't oh. remember all the numbers. But yeah. I went to the PX. <clears throat> I went to the PX and I got them. They were ninety dollars flat no tax at the PX. PX is like the little, uh, kind of like a mall on mm -hmm. base, but not. It's not yeah. really big enough for a mall. More like a general store. Yeah, gotcha. have a little bit of everything. But because it's on base, you don't pay taxes. You don't pay taxes. Like a Target, basically gotcha. for on base. A little clothes, a little electronics. You know what I'm saying? So I got those Jordans, man. Tank. I wore them till the yeah. patent leather wasn't even shiny no mm -hmm. more. Um, and then I got my first apartment in college. Uh, like, I mean, at that time, when I lived with my parents, I was able to get Jordans, Forces, stuff like that. Yeah. But then when I got my first apartment, I didn't have no extra bread for nothing. And I was like, this is stupid. Like, these Jordans, like, having these shoes, I'm hungry. Yeah. Like, I can't eat these Jordans and stuff. So it wasn't until probably 2013, 14, maybe 16, 17, I started getting little, little money from stand-up. Mm -hmm. And I, that's when I got... This is the first pair of like my resurgence back into shoes. Yeah, because I remember these are the the Vapor Max Virgil Abloh, mm -hmm. and I I didn't know what this was. Yeah, the people at all deaf all had the cool yeah, shoes. You had I was like, zip tied, yeah. it spike at price real quick. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, why though? They were like, you mean because Virgil's yeah, different? Good. Remember, the, like the, the zip tie. Yeah, yeah, I was like, what is this? You can't write this on there. But they're like, no, that's Virgil, Virgil. Yeah. So I bought these, and uh, and then I like I started. Then it is when it started. Oh, it was like. All over again, I started like getting my collection up again. It was great. You know, it was interesting when I was, especially in like elementary school, elementary and middle. I remember elementary school, my parents, my parents were always doing like okay, mm -hmm. like they they was like okay, y'all 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 ain't struggling. Like, yeah, we never yeah. struggled. That's one thing I can say. Yeah, but we wasn't. They wasn't splurging on us. Like, right, 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 at right. At all. Right. I remember in elementary school, my mama went to pay less first day of school. No, it was halfway through school because I worn out my shoes. Mm -hmm. Went there and she got me some XJ two thousands. I don't even know what that is. Nobody does. Okay, I was and when like, I tell Dang. you, 
them little broke hood rat kids at school that come, came to school in the expensive Jordans, they stayed on my neck the entire time I wore. I got into a couple of fights because I wasn't oh, like snap. I wasn't an aggressive kid. Like yeah. I was very quiet, didn't say a lot. I got picked on. Got <laughs> into a couple really? of fights. Yeah, got into. A were co- you not tall then? I was I was kind of tall, but I was quiet. So people was just like, "What's uh, up with you?" Like, nah, I'll beat you yeah. up. Like, and that's when I would that, that switch would flip, and then yeah, we got yeah, hands yeah. thrown on us. <laughs> yeah. but I never got in trouble because they knew it wasn't me starting fights. Right, right, and that's right, how right. I ended up getting like some Adidas because I'm getting into fights over these XJ two thousands. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> had a nice material. If I seen them shoes because they was dope, yeah. I liked them. Yeah, yeah. But then the hoop red kids, they they saw the opportunity, but they showing up. And all the expensive shoes, but I'm like, man, my, we live good though. I yeah. gotta pay for my lunch. You right. know, we're on free lunch, and you rocking the new shoes. That was the classic <laughs> and then, hierarchy. You pay full price. <laughs> y'all must be filthy rich. <laughs> You're not even on reduced. You pay the whole two fifty. You know what's funny is the Elevens came out. The yeah, black, yeah, the yeah. black pant leather with the mm-hmm. red sole. And I remember a dude at school, uh, Gerard. He showed up with him. Soon as they, I think he showed up with him maybe a day or two before oh, they dang. came out. I don't know where his connection yeah, was. Yeah, he had yeah. the connection, and it was like a swarm of bees. Everybody was, oh uh, my god! He was walking down the hallway. They were just swarm. He couldn't even walk. He was uh, like, oh, he was a man that day. To and be I, that <laughs> guy. <laughs> I was oh, like, these old things. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> it was never me. I bought my first pair of Jordans when I was living in California, See? out here on my own. They were some low top, like casual Jordans. They yeah. weren't even like some ones or nothing like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then like you, it was just late, recent, after the pandemic, that's when everything kind of spiraled out of control. Yeah, that's good. It wasn't just Jordans. It was a little bit of it. Oh, that's what I got. I have. <laughs> I just love that this is me. Yeah. Like, I love all, some of these shoes I don't even wear, and I don't know flex. I just like mm-hmm. the closet to feel full. Like, these I got from like a... Uh, of a shoot the production was like you want these and I was like nah, nah but- Melissa was like never throw stuff away in front of people just take it home if you don't like it but <laughs> no, these are like some skater shoes yeah. but just like until uh, I get yeah, this all full like these. yeah a little bird baby that's a, oh, that's that's a grown why, man you know, yeah, it's a little, it's a little grown man though grown that's man. perfect for the summertime <laughs> got yeah. your little linen white home do you have before I ask about you if you have a favorite pair do you have a pair of shoes that you regret getting uh, like the shoes, you was like, why did I buy them? Yeah, I do. These, I don't like these. These are Travis Scott mochas. Mm-hmm. I never, these cost a lot. And I remember like the, because I had, yeah, yeah, yeah. I had gotten these and I love the color on these. Yeah, I like that color. Yeah, but this color just looked like a little bit of doo-doo. Yeah. Just a little doo-doo. Because they show up, they show up out the box with, with the with the worn look. Yeah. yeah. And I just... I never know quite what to wear with them, mm-hmm. right? It's funny because in this, this is like a similar color, yeah. But because the green is distributed differently, and you got the gum, gum makes the gum better. make it, gum make it, it make be, everything better, gum man. make it do everything, <laughs> man. The gum you soul. The gum. You, anytime you got the gum, it's, man. It's a yeah. So yeah, those are these are the ones that I don't love because I don't really know what to wear, how to wear them. There's also. Mm-hmm. Ones that hurt my feet. Like, uh, these, oh, I regret these. You regret these? Oh, my God. I've never seen these. Marcus, on the on the small, you know, thing, when uh-huh. you go click around. They was dope. Bro, <laughs> I said, what kind of baseball <laughs> fusion crap is this? Like a baseball and a shoe had sex. <laughs> I hate these shoes, they but they cost this so much. Baby. Marcus. He was like, oh, at this price and they look dope, they gotta be fine. Yes. That's actually, I like the thing, though. That's yeah, but actually it's, a dope thing. They hurt, Marcus, and this is the... Uh, no, they don't hurt. They're ugly. There's <laughs> one that hurts. Let's step back a little bit. Where are these? See, they look like they would be comfortable. They are not. Is it just these or all fours? Not all fours. They are comfortable, I too. I cannot you. wear Jordan... These feel like I put my feet in some cinder blocks. You know I got the plant fresh y'all. <laughs> so... <laughs> But these hurt around here, too. Oh. And that was when online, a lot of people apparently don't like the way fours feel. And I don't, mm-hmm. like I said, I didn't grow up with Jordans a lot. I can't believe he played basketball in these, either. All the shoes we be wearing, he played in. I'm I like, how you run down the court in these? His feet had to be bleeding. But these are the, they are fire, though. Like, I love the way they look. Like, mm-hmm. see, if, if I had your shirt yeah, on, I would have that. I would have, if with I had the these, suede. I would have, how was that? It's 12, yeah, oh, you can't feel. Man, man. Yeah. Come on, man, grow But I love them. 
But if I wear them, I regret it every it. time. But I love to have them. I love to look at them, but I can't yeah. do it. Like, I got a, look like bubble gum a little bit. I got a pair of dunks. That one, I got a couple pair of dunks. One of my dunks, they, it's like paper at the bottom. Oh no! They, they hurt so bad. I'm like, I hate these shoes. I see, Marcus, at our edge, your feet got no, to I feel got good. I got to be comfortable. Your my, feet got the to feel good. The shoes that I wear the most. If you see me in a movie, uh, in an amusement park, you are gonna see me in some ugly shoes, and that's oh, yeah. the most comfortable shoes I Boy! got. Boy, where's your most comfortable, Ken? Man, listen, I know he done said some stuff. <laughs> like, you got to put some yeah, Kanye. Exactly. <laughs> these right here, the most comfortable you oh, got. Oh, actually, probably. These are even better. Yeah, they these look kids, like they, oh they hideous, God. so they got to be comfortable. Marcus. Look, I can squeeze that. Marcus, <laughs> this is like walking on clouds. Yeah. These are my these are my favorite plain shoes because you, you could just slide them off at the back. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Slide them on and go to the bathroom because I be peeing. Yeah. You know, I'm going to pee on that fly. Absolutely. I'm going because you know I'm a couple of gin and tonics in or, or gin and rail. <laughs> Hey, that's uh, his drink. So that's we, my drink, can't baby. Get to it, y'all, because he got he got a meeting to go to. So I got you know. Otherwise, uh, I'd be like in yeah, the meeting, like man. The thing up. about gin, gin and tiny, make you sin. But no, <laughs> any any of Kanye's EQ Boost, they feel really comfortable. Um, and and these two, these Presto Off White, you can tell I wear these. Oh yeah, I wear my shoes. Yeah, I didn't I didn't spend the bread to. They're not ours, right? To right, me, right, like yeah. I'll clean them, but I'm I'm gonna wear them. They gonna yeah. get dirty, you know what I'm saying? So these Prestos and these Prestos are probably my most because I remember getting Prestos before. I don't mm -hmm. know if you remember when they came out. Yeah, I do. Uh, you couldn't really do nothing athletic in them. Nah, you couldn't. You can't just run the twenty one. Like, yeah, you see these, right? They just a step above slipper. They're just a step, slipper with the with the with a real sole, right? But yeah, those are probably my most comfortable one i yeah. wear those today yeah i got uh yeah like i said i got all my extremely comfortable shoes are they're all nikes but they are hideous <laughs> they're the ones you look at and dicks or best buy or yes best buy. foot lock it's like who would wear them i would because that sole is thick and it's support i thought i had them in here i got some hokas with that thick bottom yeah, ho I, I got, got some. some they, they, I, I haven't put on Hoka's yet, but I'm pretty sure they get these Nikes I got, the ones I work out in, they got to feel just like the Hoka. Yeah, that's so that thick and you booty. step in it and it collapses like suspension. Oh, my God. <laughs> and my, my, that, that, that heel of, yeah. my, of my bad foot just be like, whoo! Yeah. And that's why, I like, a, a lot of these, like, hard bottom shoes, Mark, these are, this is just pain. Because oh. you can't fit. So here's my custom yeah. insoles. So I put these in, mm -hmm. right? And you can't, those don't fit into no dress shoes. Right. So anytime I'm like going to an event and I got to wear dress shoes, I, I understand what Melissa be going through. You know, women yeah. be like, no, they hate the shoes. shoes and stuff. I be like, why do you put those on? Well, you, you can't just wear Jordans with that. For men to put on a comfortable pair of dress shoes is like, oh my God, y'all been, y'all don't no, have this? this is nobody like, has it. And there's no, there's no room for the insole because they're so thin. There's none. So do you have, pain. outside of comfort, do you have a favorite pair? Oh, I, I, yeah. I treasure a lot of my shoes. Like I wear them. I after I wear them, I clean them off, mm -hmm. buy a tooth comb, put them in the box. My yeah, mine's display, but mine's are all in boxes. Put them yeah, in the yeah, box. Yeah. Put them away. I really love these Nike Air Max ninety sevens. Mm -hmm. uh, I got these when I was poor. Mm -hmm. My homeboy next door, he had ordered these off of East Bay, but then they got orders, and these were on like there's a delayed shipping. Mm -hmm. So, they had been moved for like three weeks, and the box came, and I and I looked in there. <laughs> it's like, I think you wear my size. <laughs> Let me see. So no, these are it. These no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> I ran. I wore oh. those until the until the bubble yeah, bust. Yeah, dope. Yeah. But when these came back out, I I, I cherished the memory because <laughs> it was like the one time in life I had to shoot other people had. Yeah. Uh, and my, obviously my parents couldn't afford it, and I couldn't afford it either. But these probably I cherish a lot, yeah. um, and also these Dion's, these two, these Dion's and these I remember you talked about those. This when you talked about those, those, like I was just like, that's that's a that's a dope. Like that's why I ain't been able to put feeling. them on. Yeah, it's the just like going back to my the, poor little and the self. Dion's. Oh, because like this is the best thing about like. I used to hate that shoes would come back out over and over, uh -huh. but I realized I'm I'm kind of like nostalgic for shoes the same way I'm for music. Yeah. I don't love a lot of new designs. You know what I'm saying? I, no, I can't think of any new shoe that came out that I actually like. Yeah, like I like the I like these Lebrons. I, they're not comfortable with me. I can't no. wear Lebron shoes. They're not comfortable. They're not comfortable. No, 
But I love these. I thought it was just me. I was like, Ugh. I saw some. They were dope. They looked like they had like small graffiti all over. Yeah, them. yeah. And I, I was like, oh, I'm getting. I didn't know LeBron was doing it like this. Yeah. I put them on. I didn't even walk. I just like, I ain't gonna survive in this. No, because and you know his <laughs> his used to be big bulky. Yeah. Like you be hooping in those? Are you hooping in them big old shoes? And I like these Kobe's too. These uh, those are the, those are the Kobe's. Those yeah, are. these are the, the black mambas with with Gigi on the bottom. JoJo actually put me onto these. I didn't even yeah. know that this shoe, shoe came out, and JoJo asked for them. And then obviously I was like, I'm gonna get my me a pair first. Might as well. (laughs) (laughs) You might as well. Hey. (laughs) Yeah. So, yeah, I have 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 fond feelings of a lot of these two tanks. These, these are the ones I circled the most in eBay Mm. in the history of eBay. Yeah, I remember seeing them. These were like, oh, I was an eBay kid that got nothing out of eBay too. So I, yeah, most of my friends, like I said, my parents, I knew, I, I didn't even think to ask. I was like. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You know, you know that. Finna- I, $75 I for shoes? Marcus, that Man, get wasn't out of even here. like a, like, you know that's a no. Yeah. You I, just, I didn't even want it to be a yes. I was just like, that's a, even then, I was like, that's a lot of money for shoes. Oh, that's, well, that's not how I was. Oh, is it? <laughs> but I that's how my, my parents brainwashed me. Yeah, <laughs> that's, that's good. They got it. You good. No, they did. But I circled these a lot, and then I remember my mom was, she. we was in Payless, mm-hmm. and she saw the Hakeem Olajuwon on 34 ones. I don't know if you remember those. Yeah, I do. Yeah. And she was like, you want these? And I was like, no. Mm. You remember which ones I wanted? What? And Charles Broccoli's with the grain, with the wood grain on. Yes, you was a whole Charles nigga. Broccoli with the wood grain. Yes, I you am. Wood grain. Then my cousin had them. I was like, man, I want some of them. Even once they was out of style, I said, I'm gonna go find them damn shoes. Marcus, and I'm a worm. <laughs> Even when you were young, he was old. Them Broccoli's <laughs> with the wood grain, man. <laughs> Even then, I was like, yeah, cigars and whiskey. <laughs> Yeah. Marcus, you're eight, man. I know what I am, yeah. but I know who I am yeah. as well. Y'all just wait till I'm till I'm eighteen and twenty one. I'm gonna be able to do what I want to do when I want to do it. That's hilarious. All right, so fam, this is Kev shoes. My shoes, man. How long we been out, Kev? All right, we you good with that? I'm good. I'm good. With it that. ain't got to be long to be it good. Ain't, hey, and it's hot in here. It is a little warm. <laughs> I it's turned hot. the AC on, but I realized there's no vents in here. <laughs> Oh, they know in here. You no, think I'll, they covered it up when they remodeled? I don't know. I also like these. My last thing. I like oh, these, yeah, yeah. these chocolate brown. Boots. Oh, those are chocolate. Yeah, man. Hey. Dark chocolate. Yeah. Yeah, I like those too. I but. saw you. I, you got a lot more boots than what I would have imagined for the winter time. I love me some boots, man. This is how I used to. When I lived in Washington, I used to. I used to wear more boots because it's always yeah. raining and stuff. Boots and jackets were a bigger part of my wardrobe yeah. than than now. But now in the summer, in the fall, I try to dress. You know I love me a nice boot, like a nice fall boot. Nice fall boot with 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 the, with the with dark the jeans, denim jean, like yeah. those kind of jeans. Yeah. So you got that, so you that kind of that brown trim, and you go perfect with like with these. No, oh yeah. These. With these, man, run it. Man, now I know I can fit these. What size these, kid? Marcus, you can't fit in there now. <laughs> Get out of there, Marcus. <laughs> Yeah, That's why no, I don't, I don't I, want you coming in here because I, I knew you wasn't going to be able to do nothing with me. Nah, but I, have I, your feet be like this. <laughs> Yo, man. Hey, but it look good though, don't it, kid? <laughs> feet bleeding. <laughs> All right, fam. So that's Kev's Shoes. Kev, you got anything you want to tell the people? Uh, I know they know. Patreon, man. Join us. Absolutely. Join us. It'll be join a good time. Him, Come on over. Me. Come on over. It's going to be a good time. Funky good time. Absolutely. Till next time, fam. Y'all have a good one. Bye. Bye.